All right, Dr. Darian is back, and this has become a chatty talk, talker here in the studio. These studies that say that alcohol has some positive benefits you know, are being dispelled. They're being dispelled, and a lot of holes are being poked through in these studies. So we've all heard these myths, or unfortunately, they're, they're now myths. Uh, drinking a glass a day of wine can be beneficial for your heart health because, for example, in red wine, there's resveratrol. But in this new study, looking at the effects of alcohol and true studies that are validated, it found, unfortunately, that regardless of what amount of alcohol you're drinking, it all leads to negative effects. And so it shows that even those who are moderate drinkers, and that's just one glass of alcohol a day, they have the same amount of outcomes as those who are heavy drinkers. Now, obviously, when you look at the heavy drinker group, you see more disease in terms of chronic health. But in terms of the overall longevity, longevity of life, it, unfortunately, there's no amount of alcohol that is going to be beneficial. Okay, good I'm to sorry. know. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people are probably having a tough time hearing that because uh, sometimes, honestly, a glass of wine, I can understand why it may take that tension off. Right. That's the, that, yeah. that was my question is I think that the, the one glass of wine per day or ev even every so often crowd would think, oh, maybe it's good for me, maybe it's not, but I love the ritual of it. It, like, one glass calms me down. Yeah. And you're saying just n none of that. Well, unfortunately, there's no science to prove that. Now, having one glass of wine, is that a problem? Overall, no. I think that moderation is key, but just understanding the risk. If you look at the statistics, it seems like younger generations are already understanding this. Gen Z drinking 20% less than millennials, and millennials less than those who are older than them. So more and more people are understanding this. Reaching for alternatives is probably a great idea. Making sure that you switch between water and your alcoholic drinks is also good. Yeah, mix in a water. It's right? just crazy though because people think, you know, people have been drinking forever. I know. Can it really be that bad? It can be, especially for women. It's unfortunately more likely to cause harm. So we've all got to pay attention. Good to okay. know.